Good evening, everyone. I'm Jim Hummel. And I'm Marcel Fontenot. The trial is now underway in the 1984 murder of a Crowley businessman. Jury selection started today for Ronald Dunnigan. He's on trial for second degree murder. A second suspect, Leela Mullow, pled guilty in May to manslaughter in the case and was sentenced to 30 years in exchange for her cooperation. The two are accused in the death of Gary Kurgan. He owned a number of Sonics in Louisiana. His car was found in Metairie in 1984, but he hasn't been seen since. Micah Hatfield was in the courtroom today and has the update for us. Micah. The mutual consensus of Gary Kurgan's family is that they want justice served. The victim's brother, Ted Kurgan, says he's disappointed that Ronald Dunnigan is taking the stand that he is. Ted Kurgan said outside the courtroom that Dunnigan was offered a plea deal last night. He would serve 10 years if he told the family where the body was, but he declined the offer. So 13 witnesses will testify, including Layla Mulla. Gary Kurgan was last seen with Mulla and Dunnigan before his disappearance. Today is just jury selection, but Ted Kurgan says he's been advised that the trial should be over by Friday. He says he hopes to find his brother's body, and if not, he'll be disappointed. In Baton Rouge, Micah Hatfield, KETC, TV3.